Okay, so I'm in... Splitting stumps again. Let's go south and let's see if the upper path gets me anywhere. What? A direct link? Howdy, Lee. Hi. You've been busy. My machine shows you got 75% of the flora analyzed. I've got another upgrade for you to celebrate. You'll, you'll come find me at Basin Keep Quest Hub. Hmm. Yeah, I can... Uh, yeah, I guess I better go there first. I can get here via a shortcut pretty easily, I think. Good to see you uh, all again, girl. Hi. As I said in the DM, I've got a peachy new upgrade for your hat. Y'all ready for the upgrade? Here you go. Strawberry hat. It's stronger and smells nice too. If it smells nice, won't it attract monsters? I've got a skigit daddle. See y'all. Bye. Yeah, let's see how good this really is. Hi. I earned stance... I guess a little bit botanist. Hmm. Yeah, it's an all-around all increase. Let's take it. This is Vertaville, village of Shad. Humans not welcome here, but we make exceptions for Seeker. Make no trouble. Hmm. It is humans. You are responsible for black monsters in village. Go away. Huh? Human, I know you mean no harm, but please leave Shad alone. You broke trust and now my people want war. What the heck happened? We thought we got along. Well, me the ones in the desert, but not here, I guess. Metal down. What is Seeker doing here? She is just human. Human, just human. They come into jungle full of dreams and aspiration. They want it all and try to use power of ancients to track in power of technology. You're right. Hmm. Silver. Well, that works. Plain cube. Humans have broken trust of Shad. Now we avoid them. They not sell valuable goods to filthy humans. What about Evotars? Don't trade with humans at all. I guess if we do a quest for them, maybe they'll trade again. Okay, we can jump to this section here. What does that get us? A dock? Once human and Shad were friends, now many Shad believe humans are evil. Okay, I think I found out how to get to the gold chest. Go over here and... Yep, here it is. Hmm. Okay, two more chests in the next area and a checkpoint. This place is neat. The Shads are experts in wooden construction. Even with the fierce wear of the jungle, these bridges are said to remain stable for many years. Amazing. Hmm. Did the human really bring black monster into a village? Didn't you hear about the source of black monster? It's very shiny and metal. Must be work of human. We never saw any human bring monsters or, or source in the village. That's true, but who else could done it? Only the bridge was actually... Oh, wait. There we go, permanent shortcut. Don't, that one was pretty easy to get for some reason. I cannot, I cannot trade with you humans. Humans have made jungle sick. Huh? Maybe they can only trade with us after we complete the temples. Okay, there we go. Snack mix. Okay, here in our area. Okay, got a puff plant analyzed. Oh, that's not jumpable. Okay, I can't see any way to get the chests there yet, so maybe north for now. Okay. 
Okay. You can get in reach here. Move away, human. Great Eldest has forbidden entry to old home because of black monsters. Look up to see what you humans did. You brought black monsters into our land. We had to give up Great Eldest House to keep friends here. Okay, north of here. Clinging River. Hmm. Oh no, more of these cats. God, if only they would just stay still. And not chase me all over the place. Oh no, it's raining again. Yeah, rain is all too common for this climate. Ah, get away. Too bad I'm losing a friend. What? Never mind. Huh? Wait. That stump looks suspicious. Durian. One of the grossest foods, in my opinion. How do I get all over there? Hmm. Only 38 is obtainable, so... Um, what? Was there supposed to be a bridge here? Yeah, not much I can do on this side. Hmm. Keep going up. Oh no, I have to use that to get there, don't I? Yep. Okay, good, that didn't hit the cat. That was close. There seems to be some kind of giant mole monster there. Okay, north. Oh, these cats. Once I have a way to defeat you, you will be sorry you ever tried to beg me for pets. Hey there, sweetheart. Hi. This here jungle is a Starland variety of flora. Just look at this one here. Weren't too far away, I found the same plant, but open. Ah, oh, and I found a fish inside. Well, how's exploring coming along? You all must be close to done soon, I reckon. Good to hear. Still chasing me. And these mushrooms look kind of disturbing. Oh no! I didn't mean to! Damn it, I. Shit. Let's see if I can reload anything. Oh man. Let's put this quest on hold. Okay, good. It's not going to restart every time, so let's just call this let's just call this like partial progress for now and just skip it. Uh, these cursed critters. Oh, these are, are breakable too, these mushrooms. Oh no, I can't do anything about these actually. These require wind. Yeah, might as well. And apparently the machines can damage me too. Yikes. Ooh, these are some complicated looking puzzles. What if I try to hit the machine with fire? Yep, it did. Hmm. Well, I have a feeling I'm gonna get in the fight down here.
Okay, so that gives me the platforming. If I equip the ice shoes, that would help me with the platforming, but... Oh. There. Perforated top hat. Hmm, looks like a combat area. Oh no, they're- they, I can't target them until I enter the room! What the heck? Hoping to snipe them all to death? What the hell is that thing? Oh no, do I have to help the snowman to fight these things? No, it's killing me too. Great. Oh no. So after I kill you, I got... <sighs> Holy shit, this thing is strong. Oh no. There. What? Ah, <laughs> oh, these damn cats. There's back? What? Oh shit. Die. That was the last of them, right? Save my progress. Things are a lot more difficult now that my defenses are really shit in this game. Oh, nuts! Are they gonna take pot shots at me? If I use this, could I hide be- it's theoretically hide behind their- these walls as cover? Yes, that could work. Okay. So that gets me past there and creates a shortcut. <sighs> yeah, yeah. Oh, what the heck? Oh. Hmm.
Oh shit. Okay, it's only one left. There. Oh. There. I have to get the cats to kill the snowmen first. That's the trick to winning that stupid fight. What? Break for the icy wall? Oh snap, are you serious? Hmm. There's no way to break the icy wall alone. Report back to Mrs. Basu and Basin Keep. Seriously? That sucks. Oh well. Okay, let's head over here for now. Oh no, more cats. They jump here, yes. Of course you were gonna chase me to the ends of the earth. Okay, found the path up. It's right here. Oh no, it followed me. Jump. Hmm. Okay, it's not. Ha, serves you right, cat. Oh, is this one timed? No. There! All this for Pallet Blossom. Pristine pistachios. And shortcut. Here's actually a hidden path here. Hmm. Herd dot approach. Hmm. Been walking around for some time now. Where's the temple? To the north, I think. We should be very close. Shortcut. Okay, this one requires wind. We, we can't do it yet. Hmm. Should I be here yet? Yeah, might as well. through here. Destroy more honeycombs. Is there another chest around here that I can grab? Yes. Energy Expresso.
Please, calm down. Shadow will not stand down. Humans have poisoned Great Jungle. No more. We block entrance for all safe to, ju uh, to save jungle. This is too much for a single guard. I'm sorry, very sorry, Seeker, but as you can see, we have a situation here. The Shad formed a wall and blocked the path to Grand Criscajo and its trials, including your, our power plant. They let no one through and are clearly agitated. I fear that as long as they're acting this way, no Seeker can progress any further. To be honest, I'm not sure what to do. What we need here is an official statement from our mayor. I have yet to receive any instructions concerning this whole mess. Seeker, it would be a huge help if you could send words to the mayor. Thank you, I'll try and hold the fort here. Seems the fate won't let us reach the temples just yet. Let's quickly seek an aud audition with the mayor before this conflict escalates any further. You mean audience. So back to the city again. Humans have broken trust of Shad. Oh bother. Hmm. Well, man, I may as well check out this area here. Get some more botanic scans in. And hope I don't get sick from all these evil looking mushrooms. This place looks different. That's right, we're within an infested jungle. A mysterious disease has befallen this part of the forest. Oh, hey, a new enemy. It's not automatically hostile. So that's a good sign. At least for me and my exploring ways. But there's not much I can do here without the wave element, is there? Can I actually get there? What?! Oh, come on! Oh, shoot. Ow. Come on, drown. Unbelievable, it just ambushed me like a jerk. They can hide underground too. Are there any tells to, as to when they'll appear though? That was not part of a quest, that was just a jerk enemy that likes to ambush you. Is there like something sticking out of the ground for me to look at? Hmm. Okay, should be another checkpoint north. I think these chests are getting tougher and tougher. I may have to... Look up a video guide for some of them. Infested marshes. It's just more and more of these cats everywhere. So you assume they're not edible. Oh, come on! How am I supposed to tell you're even there? Ah, uh, even when he's stunned, he's just gonna... He's just gonna set himself on fire so I can't use nor uh, close range attacks easily, huh? Hmm. Are these guys, like, set encounters or something? I'm not sure. Oh, maybe I can find... Ah. Uh, get off, cat. That's my mushroom. Platform. Maybe I should go back an area and see if I can get anything more from that platform. Hmm. Venom Shroom. That side could be tough. Hmm. Mega sandwich. And that one's wind only. Hmm. 
Infested marshes north and I'm locked in. Okay, here. Probably run into another one of those jack-o'-lanterns just popping out of nowhere. Yep. Oh shit, we pissed off one of them. Oh, come on. Oh crap, did it self-destruct? Did it cause all the R1 to respawn as well? Yes, it did. Okay, we managed to get the f this one over here now. Yeah, I think it's self-destruct. They even managed to kill Apollo in one hit. This is messed up. What an admirable and perfectly average mushroom. And it's probably more of those jack-o'-lantern things. They see me set encounters too. Considering how quickly they respond like that. Hi. Okay, blazing bun. So all that's over here. There, shortcut activated. Look up there. There we go. Um. He got that activated. Let's hope there's no more jack lanterns on this map. <sighs> this is the other side of infested marshes. Let's see if there's any more areas available to me. Just a shortcut here. Lazy Claw. I'm gonna need that for forging later. Okay, I managed to climb up to here. Let's see. Alright, I made it all the way up here. Now what? Hmm. Oh, cr two! Fuck. Ah, uh, that was close. Do we get both Jack's flames? How many more do we need? It's one more. And we can't go north yet. Okay, there's apparently no entrance I can use around here. Yes, this might be the key to getting to some of those more difficult chests. There we go. Okay, what happens if I hit this switch? 
It's not timed. Okay. So... How do I get there again? I think I need to get down from the other side. Yeah, I have to get there from the other side. Yep. How do I... Uh, I just gotta remember how to platform my way all the way back there. Let's see. Um... Okay, through here. Probably run to a jack-o'-lantern at some point. Jump across. It's a bit of a too far of a jump. Let's go this way. Okay, golden bars, but I don't see that final jack-o'-lantern yet. Okay, can I jump over here? Yes, I can. Okay, I made it up here. Any points of interest? There we go. There's the chest I was looking for. Spicy Beto type. Okay, jump from this mushroom to here. Hopefully this will get me to the last fucker. Okay. Finally. So now I need to do some mushroom hopping. Virus root. Sweet. Yeah, that there. Who was that? Probably going to go to the mayor's office. Bumps for everyone. Ha! Wow, that was rude. Her again. So this is not the first time it happened. You have to listen to me, Mayor Sullivan. You again. If you want to speak to me, please make an appointment. This is an emergency. Things are about to escalate. I'm so sorry, sir. sir. She just burst in. It's okay, Penny. This seems important. You can go. Yes, sir. Alright, so what is it? The village of Verda is currently under attack by dangerous creatures. We've already lost the entire north part of the village. Well, I'm very sad to hear that, but how does this concern us in any way? You see, the Shattered are blaming the power plant. Well, well, of course, they always do, and I always tell them the same thing. The power plant is fine, but make sure it's all in perfect harmony with your oh-so-holy track. Please listen, things are not the same. We are desperate. The Shad now start, start a protest in front of the Grand Criscajo as we speak. They want to stop the power plant and are ready to use force. What? You Shad want to use force? With sticks and stones? Don't make me laugh. I know you hold a little respect for us, but I beseech you, don't let us end in a bloodbath. What choice do I have? You know as well as I do that we depend on the power plant. We can't simply turn it off. I'm very much aware. What you can do is help us free the village from those creatures. If you do, things might calm down again. A few of your guards shall suffice. You wild people come around your pay proms, and I'm supposed to spare some guards for you? Speaking of annoyances, what's that seeker doing back there? Hi? Oh, I didn't even see you there. Well, isn't this perfect? If you need somebody to deal with your secret creatures, I'm sure a seeker like this will do the job. If you want to access the temples of the north, it's in your interest to resolve this dispute quickly, right? Please, seeker, we are in dire need of help. Nods. Thank you so much. Great, that solves it. The Seeker can do her thing and everybody will be happy. And now see you hold low respect for Seekers as well. My job here is to run a city in the middle of a dense jungle. I don't have time for wild people and adventures. You two do what you must to solve your problems. 
And make sure you free the passage to the power plant soon or it will become another problem for you. Now if you'd please excuse me. Meet me outside, Seeker. I'll tell you everything I know. I've had enough of his arrogance. Such arrogance. This man encapsulates himself in his own world, blocking off all outside issues. Indeed, very much like this iron-walled city. Seeker, aren't you there? Aren't there some wild people you need to help? What a jerk. Hopefully he'll learn some valuable life lessons. I'm sorry, Seeker, but thanks to that, this noisy chat, I have to sit my hands full with rescheduling. Seeker, over here. Thank you for helping us. The tension between humans and Shad around here is as bad as it gets. It really doesn't help that the mayor is acting so selfishly. But where are my manners? I'm Katara. Lee, hi. I was born in Rudaville, a small village in the southeast of Gaia's Garden. But I spend a large amount of time with humans. Anyway, let's not dwell for too long. My village is in danger. You see, our village was attacked by strange black cats. They've already pushed me out of the north side. It's because of this power plant. It's disrupting ancient track and it's punishing us for it. And my people are not happy. They are ready to fight and I fear the worst if we don't do something. I'm sure if we can drive these beasts away, the shadow will calm down, but we have to act fast. Let's first meet in Vertoville. There's a landmark in the eastern part of the village. Oh, you already unlocked it. Let's not waste time then. That was clever use of sign language, Lee. And the NPC even recognized it. I'm impressed. Okay, let's turn it in this quest here. Hi. Welcome back, Seeker. Have you made progress on your assignment? Nods. Lee. I see. So you managed to secure only some of the machines before that criminal snow creature blocked your way. An aberrant Corrado from Bergen Trail invading Gaia's garden to steal cooling devices. This is outrageous. Indeed, and it presents a threat e even beyond this robbery once it properly solves down. Not on my watch. I will instruct my best technicians to find a way through that icy blockade. Seeker, you have proven your worth. I hope you will return and finish this job once preparations are right. Sir, how noble of you. Well, Seeker, I hope you will not let us down. Please return to us in the future. Bye. Level up. Okay, here, oh, here's the village. Indeed, far from Basin Keep. This tribe is not in friendly terms of humankind. Did I get that lore before? Sometimes they repeat their dialogue. Hmm. Okay, now that I have good defenses, once again, I should try dealing with Boosie Man's quest. Hi. I see you collected the flames. Terrific. Things are almost ready then. The only thing we need to do is a test run. Tiny one, can I count on your help once again? Nods. Spooktacular. I'll be inside constructing everything. It'll only take the ghost of a second. Just follow me inside when you're ready. Test run of a new attraction. I'm a little nervous. I'm guessing this is going to be an instance dungeon. Welcome to Pumpkin Funland. Please enter the teleporter to start your ride. Yup. Definitely looks instanced here. Looks like I'll have to ride on a platform, maybe? It says it's a ride? Oh, I can go back whenever I want. Uh, let's explore it then. Seems it's not instanced yet, so I can rely on my allies to... What? To act as meat shields for now. Not all of them are glowing, is that fine? Yeah, this place is super creepy. And we're locked in, but these- and that means- Are enemies gonna snipe us from here? What do you expect me to do? A switch? I knew it!
One down. Why? What? There's a tab? What the hell? Well, that's slightly annoying. Oh, crap. Two of them. Well, yeah, I am taking way less damage now. But I, I still want to watch out for their... For that self-destruct move that they have. Whoa! Aha! Ah! Okay, let it cool down. We can't save in here! Oh shoot, that's disturbing. We're in a different room now and still cannot save. Yikes. Were we able ever be able to escape this place? How the hell am I supposed to know how to dodge it? There's no rhyme or reason here. This is getting really fucking annoying. Ah. Uh. Damn, these guys won't let up. Ow. Dang, my, my tanking is just enough to deal with this sh- Ow. Okay, so, uh, you guys still alive? Yikes. Yeah, having really high defenses helps, doesn't it? Okay, but seriously, how the hell do I get out of here? Terrific, just terrific. Tiny one, seems you have already had great fun in Pumpkin Land. Can I leave yet? Unless we're not done yet. It's time for the grand finale. See ya, boss. Oh shit. One down. Dang it, I'm almost over elementing. Wow, these guys are pretty tanky against anything that's not ice, huh? Okay, let's go back to using ice. oh yo Get wrecked. What the heck? What's with all that fire? Oh, come on. Apollo is dying, and that's not good. Dang it, Apollo. Get get good. Weren't you supposed to be uh, better than me at being a Stromancer? Come on, man. Ah. So we gotta keep dodging the flames while trying to deal with this shit. Oh boy. And Paul's already dead, isn't he? Dang it. What good are my party members that they can't tank for me? Oh crap, even more. Oh, what the? He revives! Ah. Oh, I'm dead. Okay, so this could be bad. Oh 
Okay, so, uh... Everyone's dead except for me. And I'm gonna die soon. Holy shit. Uh, let me eat, 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 eat. Ow. My goodness. Is that it? Okay, good. Even though my allies died a million times, I still won. But good to know they revive after a while. Wonderful, wasn't this great? Well, I sure had plenty of fun, tiny one. It's hard enough to hunt anybody in the city with everybody one so busy. So I knew I had to aim for something big, start a proper boozeness. It's the only way to get any attention these days. Well, I sure call this a success. Thanks a lot for your participation, tiny one. Bye. Scarecrown. Only 300 experience. I did get a little bit of money, so how good is the scare crown anyways? Uh I guess I get a little bit of flash step, that's good. Lucky lucky. Oh look, it's another spirit answer. Hi. Hmm, so you're level 43. That's pretty common level for Gaia's Garden. Or so I was told anyway. You see, when I reached Basin Keep, I was already level 99. Huh? How? I bashed hedgehogs, lots of them. Back in Autumn's Rise. For a very, very long time. Why? Are you Seiya Ryugoin? Because I needed the EXP. Best way to get them at high level. Killing lots of hedgehogs one EXP at a time. 1,000 hedgehogs per level for well over 50 levels. I reached level 99. Over an endless trail of dead hedgehogs. I am a hedgehog's worst nightmare. Bye. Alright, we're going in. Sermancer Lee, this quest will make us prove our worth alone. Do not bring shame upon our noble class. Oh no. Demanding squawking. Hi, Lee. Hi. Annoyed squawking. Lee. Aggressive squawking. Oh crap. Ah, they saw that stupid watermelon attack. <laughs> oh no. Get down here, you coward! Oh, nuts. Friending bird noises! Oh, m please, Miss Seeker, free me from this scoundrel so I can go home safely! S stun with a charge attack. Okay. Be careful not to hit the hostage. Yikes. I think I can just kill him with... Ah, oh, shit. Damn it. This is gonna suck. There we go, I can just stand on the desk or something. Apparently, NPCs with more refined communicative recognition have been implemented at this point. It's a shame that your vocabulary is not up to the task. 
Huh. So we gotta do this the hard way. Let's try this again without losing hostages. Escape! Okay, I need to... A good way to... Escape! Ah, oh, shit. Again with the... Horrible hostage. Escape! Okay, how do I get rid of you? Wow, that's a horrible. Escape. Let's run. Buzz saw the face. Okay, I think I got all the hostages saved this time. It's really hard to tell. The moment I go through there, it's gonna be another frigging hostage situation. Ah, crap. How do I get that other one? Escape. Oh no. There. These guys can't hurt. Yeah, I'm glad I got extra defense for this fight. There. Save. I wonder if I get more rewards if I save all the hostages. Oh, nuts. There's too many of them. Hostage tolerance, oh shit. Ow. Damn, this is a tough one to aim.
Okay, that works. So where's the other one? I don't even know what to do with the, those for. Are you kidding me? They're still going, eh? <sighs> How unlucky that there's like exactly one hostage for every bird. God damn it, this reflection thing is really... Hurry up and escape, you fools. Goodness, so okay. Uh, that's all the hostages, I think. Saw to the face. Oh snap, that's a lot of them. Uh various more noises. Oh come on. Really? Fine. I'll just tank it all with my stupid defense. Uh. Oh, good. Okay, my defenses are not enough here. Sandwich. Come at me, bro. Ah, oh, shit. They're they're doing that move. Ah, oh, shit. Wrong one. Ha-ha! You're all alone now. No one to save you! Ha-ha! Okay, all hostages just saved. All birds killed. Yep. Gotta do some editing because of that hostage part I screwed up that one time. Oh. Oh yeah. Hi. Finally, you're back. We heard a lot of noise in there. I assume you couldn't solve it peacefully. That's a shame. Would have made our reports easier and saved a lot of trouble with the press. In any case, you clear up the situation and prevented serious damage. We can count that as a win. I will call the sergeant and give him a brief report. Get, go back to HQ to get your reward. 
Bye. Hi. Oh, don't give me that smug look, see uh, Seeker. You stir up a lot of trouble if you're a little shootout. Messing up the negotiations, starting an office brawl around the hostages. We got traumatized white collars and the press slamming our ears about your methods. You're a loose cannon, Seeker. Still, I can't deny you got the results. The problem has been the result without major injuries. Alright, I'll let your method slide this time. Take a reward and stay in touch. Bye. Chili dog and star fruit. Okay, so they were actually discussing the quest. To a nine violent path to solve the quest. It was hella interesting. Too bad I messed it up midway through. Even so, I heard it effectively talking th th these birds would lower their morale and make the fight easier. Oh boy, it was that complex, eh? Really impressive how far they are pushing some of those late game quests. I hope the developers continue on this path. It's so satisfying to use diplomacy instead of violence for once. Hi, how? Ah, oh, hi, well, a fellow Sparrowmancer. That's rare. So you wonder how those misguided birds could be dissuaded from violence with mere words? It's easy. Just open your heart and think of what led them down their dark path, what they might desire. Yes, that. But I assume it comes down to triggering some flags with the right words or something. You do not see much for talking. Hmm. Well, I guess some players prefer to simply hit things. You do you, girl. Bye. Thanks for tuning in to this Let's Play of CrossCode. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, and or hit the bell icon.